even go. I'm on my way to the top, like I can't be below. They telling me that I'm crazy, like I ain't even know. Hit him with a G33, and now you see him fine. One me, two goons. Hey y'all, welcome back. I'm just now getting off my pharmacy job. It's probably around 8 or 9 o'clock p.m. Um, and I come in and I go straight to walking my babies. I like to walk them one at a time because Sadie, oh my gosh, this big baby, she drags me, okay? So I have to walk them one at a time. Um, she's on her period, so she has a disposable or a rewashable diaper, and I almost forgot my poop bag, so I had to go back and get that, because we don't want no issues. So, I'm going to go ahead and walk her, and then we are going to walk Enzo. Now, Enzo, uh, he's still learning on the leash. He still stops and sits while I'm walking. It's a lot going on with Enzo, but we're trying to train him. We're trying to work with him. Um, it seems like since we moved, he's been moving backwards as far as potty training. So I don't know if, I don't know. I just don't know what I'm going to do with this potty training because he's been definitely moving backwards. Um, but yeah, that's little Enzo. We are about to move on to feeding time. I feed them both in the cage just to make it fair. And so nobody's eating somebody else's food. Nobody is food aggressive, neither Enzo or Sadie. But I just like to keep them separate while eating because, you know, Enzo's a puppy. So he's going to linger off into other bowls. Oh, yeah. And they, nobody pooped. Nobody pooped at all. And that was that was frustrating. Um, but. Yeah, I told Sadie to go in her cage, and I'm getting all the bows together so I can get their dinner ready. Um, like I said, I put them both in their cage to eat because I don't want Enzo to linger on to Sadie's food and eat her portions. And then I got to figure out how much to give Sadie because she didn't get her full portion and stuff like that. So I just like to feed them separate so we don't have no problems. So, yeah. One thing I love to do is take off my eyelashes. It's just like taking off a bra. Oh, it feels good. And y'all taking off this wig as well. So once I take my wig off, I always put my bonnet on. I walk around in my bonnet at home. I do not walk around in this wig, okay? And I make sure I got all the glue and crusties out of my eye from the eyelashes. And then we're going to move on to cleaning. Every time I come home from work, I try to straighten up or clean a little bit. Just in case, and just in case somebody calls me and says, hey, can I come over? Or, hey, I want to come over and talk to you about something. My house is already basically clean. Um, I would just have to pay, like spray some for a breeze and, you know, probably like sweep a little bit, but nothing too major. But I always try to keep my dishes down. Always. Um, my last apartment, I did not do that. But I have definitely, since I've been here, been putting it in this routine because I refuse to have a messy kitchen. And I'm literally looking at it from being like it connected to the living room. Like I refuse. So now I'm going to make me some dinner. I wasn't really hungry, but I always make myself eat something because I need to have something on my stomach. I don't want to feel like I'm starving myself. Even though I feel like I'm not hungry, I know I haven't eaten in a while. So I'm going to make me a little bowl with a big bowl of cereal. I love cereal. Y'all, I could eat cereal all day, honestly. But yeah, I made me some Honey Nut Cheerios um, and some whole milk. And we are about to start editing. I love to edit while I eat dinner or breakfast or anything. I, I love editing, honestly. It can be a hassle, but I love doing it. Um, I love the outcome of the videos when I'm done editing. So I'm editing and airdropping videos from my um, laptop to my phone and, you know, putting the clips together and just like 
seeing how I would want this video to play out basically. Every day after work, I try to go out on my balcony when it feels good. Um, and I'll read my Calm Your Anxious Mind book. Um, it's kind of like, uh, it has like Bible scriptures in it and stuff like that. So just to kind of guide me through, basically guide me through my hardships and to calm my mind. Um, so I've got this book from CVS. So if you would like this book, I can try to find it on Amazon and I'll link it down below. But I've really been trying to read this book either every night or every day. And I love this book. OK, it's like a, the perfect daily bread book for me, even though I read it at night because I'd be rushing in the morning. So I would like to more so read it when I'm about to go to bed. I love it. And this is my baby. Oh, my goodness. She loves me on the balcony. Lord. So now I'm just getting my bath ready. I love to soak in some tea tree oil. This is the brand that I love the most. So it really works with my skin and my eczema. So I put a little bit of that in the tub and I put some hot water and I let it run. And I also have this tub tray that I also use and I put in a tub when I'm soaking in tea tree oil and I'm gonna make me a little drinky drink and I'm gonna listen to music and I'm gonna just soak for probably about 10 maybe 15 minutes and then I'm gonna end up taking my shower but I really like to wind down when I'm getting off work because work stresses me out oh and this is my favorite face cleanser so far until I find a new routine this is the brand that I use and this is the lotion that some oh this man put me on this lotion and I love this lotion oh my gosh yes but before we get in the tub and chillax we are going to go ahead and do our dental care brush our teeth floss and mouthwash Yes, I'm on the toilet. I try to use the bathroom or poop or pee or what, whatever I got to do before I get in the tub. Because don't you hate when you get in the tub or the shower and then you got to use the bathroom? I hate it. Oh, my gosh. But, yeah, I'm just vibing, editing, listening to music, drinking my wine, texting people. Y'all, this is really a wine dine wind down soaking moment for me and i really love doing this after work after i done did everything walk the dogs fed them you know gave them some attention stuff like that i really love winding down like this with a good tea tree soak and then after i get all i feel like i've soaked it all up <laughs> i'll go ahead and take my shower and then I'll proceed with my nighttime routine and then I'll go to bed. But as you see, I'm I'm washing my face and vibing right now. <laughs> So we're going to dry off and lotion up and get ready for bed. I had to like zoom in a little bit because I didn't want y'all to see any goodies, y'all. I'm sorry. 
But yeah, I love to put on this lotion and it smells so good. It makes me feel so nice before going to bed. Oh, I love it. And I'm also going to put this cortisone on my neck because I have bad eczema on my neck. So I like to put it on this side because this is the main side I get it on. I don't know why it's been like that since I was a child. So I make sure I put some on my neck before bed. And I also put some on my hand as well because I start getting a little flare up right here. And I'm going to put some um, toner on my face. The same brand of the face cleanser. So after I put the toner, the lemon toner around my face, I am going to put a face balm on the same brand, same um, scent as well. And then we're going to get ready to go to bed. <laughs> So the guy I used to mess with a while ago put me on to rain noises while sleep. Now I just can't stop doing it. Like I can't go to sleep without the noise. So Sadie knows the noise. That's why she's looking at me wagging her tail. She knows that means bedtime. Um, she always sleeps in the bed. Enzo does not sleep in the bed because he's still not fully potty trained. He actually just peed on my bed the night before this video and I had to wash my sheets. So yeah. Um, me and her are going to go to sleep. I'm trying to get her situated. And good night, y'all. I hope you guys liked the video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll be posting once a week, if not more than once a week. We're coming back to back to back to back to back with these videos, guys. So I hope you guys are enjoying the content. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.